Hey guys, how you doing? So, sorry I got food on my face. I just finished snacking. But anyways, um, how's the weather where you are? It is hot. H-O-T, hot here. It's burning up, you guys. But let me tell you about your little friend, Chunky. About your little grandbaby, Chunky. About your niece, Chunky. About your cousin, Chunky. You know, we family. Let me tell you about what she did. We're at class. Her little class that she goes to. And she over there playing with the blocks. You know, cool. You, you play with the blocks. She was by herself at first. And then this little boy, she was playing with the brown blocks. This little boy came over there and he wanted to play with the colored blocks. So, she looking at him play with the blocks. She turned around for the brown blocks. Turn around and started playing with him. I was like, Chunky, make sure you're sharing. Because, you know, sometimes she wanted to share. So, she told the little boy, you share. And he told her, like, girl, get out of my face. I said, no, you don't tell him to share. I'm talking to you, Chunky. You better share. So, they started fighting up the blocks. I knew it was going to happen because, you know, she's still learning to share. I knew something was going to happen. So, they fighting up the blocks. I was like, no, no, no. I said, um, share. So, she was like, okay. So, she gave him... She hands him a block. She's like, here, I'm sharing. So, here's her. He's like, okay. So, he left her alone. He's like, I'm going to go play with these trucks because this girl tripping. So, he went and played with the trucks. So, then Chunky turns around. She wants to play with the trucks. Yeah, it's like 1,500 different trucks there. Why are they fighting over the same truck? I was like, okay, Chunky, we're finna go. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't got time for it. So she was like, no, mommy, no, I'm going to share. So, you know, they started sharing and everything. So then here comes another little boy. First thing he go to is the trucks. Chunky snatches the trunk, the truck from him. I was like, no, Chunky, share. So the, the little boy who's there first, he go play with the blocks again. So Chunky follow him, and they go play with the blocks together. So then the other little boy, the, the new one that came over there, he want to play with the blocks. So they all three of them fighting over these blocks. Mind you, it's two boxes full of blocks. So I'm like, Chunky, no. I said, you better share or we're going to leave. So she tells the boys, she was like, share, share, share. Like she pointed them to my share, share. I was like, no, you don't tell them to share or whatever. So I know she bossy. So the, the little boy who's over there at first, he started Repeating out the chunky, he was like, share. And he telling the other little boy, share. I let my mouth from the go, because I didn't want to stay older and these little kids fighting and everything. So then uh, the mamas of the two boys, they laughing. They think it's funny. I don't think it's funny because I know my child is bossy. And when she don't get her away, she yells, screams, push, all that stuff. So I was like, chunky, we finna leave. So she's like, Muffy, 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 Muffy. You didn't even say hi with your Muffy. food all over your face. Say hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Say what's up. Mm-hmm. Say how you doing. How you doing? You gonna show them your earrings you broke? Uh huh. Yeah, she broke her earring, yeah. Mommy. Mommy fixed it. So, mm -hmm. you know, they telling each Mommy. other shit. Perfect. Okay, hold on. Let me fix so, you know, they. All three of them, so they're telling each other to share or whatever, and they wasn't sharing. So, Chunky snatches the the blocks and the trucks up and go hand it to one of the mamas. And she was like, what am I supposed to do with this? And Chunky was like, share. <laughs> she told the mama to share them. Yeah, Chunky is something else. So, we left from there, and then we walked to the uh, pet store because Chunky likes to look at the different animals or whatever. And I don't mind uh, walking with her to the pet store because I don't plan on bringing none of those things home. They got guinea pigs and birds and rats and fish and whatever. We'll do. Yeah, tell me why. When we Every time we go in there, I let Chunky just, you know, select, select which, you know, hour we're going to go down next or whatever. Tell me why. This girl... First, when we, when we first walk in there, you see the uh, ferrets, whatever. If they have the ferrets out, you see the ferrets playing 
and then you see the guinea pigs, and then you see the rats. Well, with woo. So we're looking at the guinea pigs and everything, and I'm listening. You know, you got to be real your surroundings. I heard one of the workers say, "It can eat a toddler." That's exactly what she said. It can eat a toddler. So you know, I'm like, you know, I was listening, but I wasn't listening. I'm like, eat a toddler. What is she talking about? So Chunky goes around the corner. I follow behind her. Why is my child standing there with three grown men? Three grown men who had this big old, well, one of them had this big old snake around his neck. Like, I guess it was an anaconda, honey, because it was huge around his neck. And then the other dude, he was holding a little smaller snake. Why my child Mama. over there with them? I said, Mama. Snake. Yeah, Got snake. It. Bird. Yeah, birds. I was like, oh, no, 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 no. So I grabbed my child and, you know, when I grabbed her, she was like, no, mommy, because she wanted to touch it. No, you're not going to touch nothing, especially not no snakes. So the dude was like, it's okay. I'll hold it. She can, she can touch it. All lies, not my child. She not. Baby, baby, because if that snake. Snaps at my child and swallow her whole. I seen the movie Anaconda. I know how they work. No, Mama. baby. Mama. She not finna touch that snake. And I told, I told her. I said, I said no, Chunky, it'll eat you. She said, like, eat me. I was like, it'll eat you. She's like, okay. Eat you. Yeah, it, was, it could eat both of us. The snake eat you. Yeah, snake. Come tell them about the snake. Tell them what the snake did. Mama. So anyways. I pull her away from the boys with the snakes. So we go over towards the fish. We over there looking at the fish chunky, you know. She's Dory and Nemo and you know, pulling out the fish and everything. Why one of them boys come over there to where we at? Excuse me, excuse me, ma'am. I wanted to say, what do you want? That's what I wanted to say, but I didn't say that. I was like, yes. He was like, your daughter is so beautiful. I was like, thank you. And he's like, and the mommy is beautiful too. I said, oh, you know her mommy? And he looked like he was confused. So me and Chucky just walked out, honey. Why did this boy follow me? Y'all, it, <laughs> I did not want to be loud in this store. I did. So I was like, oh, please don't follow us. And he was like, oh, I'm sorry. <sighs> so he go put the snake down he comes back he was like i put it up i was like i still don't want you to follow us he was like well what's wrong he was like why are you being mean i was like i'm not being mean i just don't like people that i don't know follow me and my child around he was like i just want to talk to you for a minute see how you're doing and everything <sighs> yeah i was like i'm okay <sighs> yeah this boy was working my nerves. He was like, you live around here? Boy, I'm not finna tell you where I stay so you can start stalking me. I got enough stalkers that I gotta deal with. That's what I wanted to say. But I didn't say that. I was just like, mm-hmm. He was like, okay, cool. He was like, uh, you gonna buy something for your daughter? I was like, no, I just want her to look. He was like, well, you know, whatever she want, I'll pay for it. No, boy, get away from me. Stop trying. I was like, ooh. But I didn't say that. I just was like, oh, no, you don't have to. You're so sweet, so kind. Yo, ooh. Like, I don't really want to be mean. I don't, I, don't, I don't want to be mean. But sometimes people get on my nerves. It was hot that day. Well, happened today. It was hot. It was hot outside. It's just I didn't want to be bothered. I just wanted my child to have a good time. I wanted us to leave. I can't keep a great eye on my child, a good eye on her, if you're bugging me. You know. Y'all, that boy's getting on my nerves. I was like, come on, Chunky, let's go. You know, she she wasn't ready to go because she didn't get to see everything. She liked to look at everything, every reptile, animal, whatever they have in there. She won't look at it all. So, we go over to the next hour where they had the uh, lizards and snakes and everything. So, Chunky points to the snake. She said, snake, 
And I was like, yes, yeah, a snake. So she points to the boy and says, snake. I start laughing. And here he comes. Yeah, baby, I have a snake. Boy, if you don't get your... Ooh, yeah, this boy getting on my nerves. Yeah. I was like, come on, Chuck. So we go to the next hour. Now, the next hour, they normally have, like, uh, cats or whatever. Well, sometimes they have cats, sometimes they don't. So we, she was looking for the cat. I was like, Chunky the cat. And I heard somebody must have bought the cat already because they don't be having that many cats in. Chunky was like, oh, okay. So she was like, we finna go? I said, like, yeah. So I said, like, come on, say bye to all the animals. Cause when we get ready to leave, she likes to go each out and say bye to everything in it, right? Which I don't mind. But if this boy with a snake is standing somewhere, I don't want to. I'm trying to get away from him. My child, she doing her little routine, saying bye to everything. The three boys, they stand up by the door to leave. So we didn't have no choice but to go past them. So, she was like, bye-bye, you know what I'm saying, bye. And then she get to the boys with the snakes, and she's like, bye. And, you know, they wave back. They're like, bye, sweetheart. This boy, let me walk you to your car. I was like, I didn't drive up here. I walked. He was like, okay, let me walk you home. Boy, no, you not finna walk nowhere and follow me with this snake. And you especially not finna follow me to my house. Y'all, ooh. Ooh. Like, why? What? Well, why? Ooh. Why? Why was he so persistent and wanting to get to know me and follow me? Like, I don't look friendly. Like, I'm not a friendly person at all. Like, I know a lot of people... That think I'm friendly, but I'm really not. Especially when it comes to my child. When I have my child with me, I'm definitely not friendly. Yeah. I walked outside, and I walked to the next door. And the next door was the grocery store. I walked up in there. I was like, if this boy following me in here, I'm going to beat him down with a turkey leg. You know, he didn't come in there. Ooh, yeah. I just, mm -mm. I don't know. I'm... I'm trying to be like ever since I had chunky I I am more sensitive I'm you know I try to be more nice to people because I want her to be nice I don't want her to be mean but sometimes people just get on my nerves I just don't want to be bothered with anybody especially nobody that's trying to holler yeah Ooh. but yeah I didn't want nothing I just want to see what y'all up to are y'all getting the crazy rain like we're getting it rain sun rain sun crazy Oh my God, it's so crazy. But, you guys, I've been drinking a lot of water. More than what I have been drinking. And, excuse me, you guys. Um, I, <laughs> I was about to say I haven't been snacking that much, but that would be a lie. Because I just ate these m and <laughs> for Chunky. So that's the thing. Huh, her daddy, they always getting snacks and stuff and offering me some. And I don't want to be rude and say no. No, thank you. I don't want to do that. So, you know, I take a few and I eat a few. Yeah. I know. I can say no. But I can't say no. I just want to taste a little bit. Just a little bit won't hurt. But um, I'm trying to slow up on the coffee. I'm trying to leave the coffee alone. But I done bought a bunch of coffee. That I'm not going to let go to waste. So, you know, I've been drinking it but not. Every day, like I normally do. You know, I normally drink the coffee before I go to bed. I haven't been doing that every day like I normally do. So I've been having trouble sleeping. And, uh, you know, let me tell y'all something. Y'all know how I told y'all when Chunky don't take no nap, she go to bed at 6. Yeah. Yesterday, she didn't have no nap. I'm thinking, okay, it's almost 6 o'clock. She finna wind down and go to bed. Then, you know what I'm saying? I can clean the kitchen, take my bath, and do everything I need to do. Baby, she was up, up, just running, screaming. Y'all know she talk loud. I was like, why does she have so much energy? Like, she didn't have no nap, but she had bukus of energy. And I was like, maybe it was the food. I'm like, no, nah, we didn't eat nothing sweet. I'm like, what? What is going on? Yeah. I think she's just at the age now where she don't need naps, and she's still going to have Buku's energy. 
Anyways, how you guys doing? How you living? How your family? Are y'all getting ready for the 4th of July? You know, I'm I'm excited about the 4th of July because y'all know I love holidays. Don't have any big plans, but I just love holidays, you guys. Um, hopefully, I find those uh, 4th of July nails at Dollar Tree before the 4th. <laughs> but, yeah. Uh... I guess I let you go, whatever. Don't need to take up no more of your time. I thank you guys for watching. I hope y'all are having a blessed day. Bye bye. Say hi. Hi. Say how you doing? Hi. I'm Harden Hayden. You're a princess? Yes. Okay, cool. Y'all, yeah, she loves eating tomatoes. Is it good? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a delicious mama.